children how are you all hope you all are fine children in the last class we learned exercise 4.1 isn't it with a single divisor we were dividing the sums with a single divisor and i have omitted the exercise 4.2 we later on we'll see that one and now i am going to teach you exercise 4.3 okay children don't get confused okay after 4.1 i am teaching 4. Three. Don't think oh 4.2 misses sent. I didn't write like that. No need to be confused. I I have omitted that uh, chapter. Uh, later on, when we have time, we will uh, look into it. Okay, children. Now exercise 4.3. Okay, divide to find. Divide to find the quotient and the remainder find the quotient and the remainder quotient and the remainder the same thing as we learned in the last class only understood children that is with single digit now two digit and the remainder if any okay it's in for page number it's in page number uh, 64 it's in page number 64 it's page number 64 the same thing only okay children first sum we'll see 92 divided by 14 see 19 divided by 92 divided by 14 so 92 divided by 14 means see this is the Divided and fourteen is the divisor. Don't forget this is divided and this is divisor and this is divisor. Understood? Which is the dividend should be inside and the divisor should be outside. Okay. See, children, when we had four means, we will write the four digit, the uh, four tables. Now it's two digit. So how can we divide children? It's too hard. But the easy way is how we have to um, see fourteen. All of you know fourteen ones are fourteen. Fourteen ones are fourteen, isn't it? So you can write from two. Fourteen twos are see two fours are eight. Two one is two. So if you refine like this, it will be very easy for you. You have to write till ninety-two uh, or an abila. You can find out. See, I will teach you. You can find out. Two fours are eight. Two one is two. See, see here three three. Okay, sorry three. Four three is a twelve. Three fours are twelve, and three one is three. Three plus one four forty two. So likewise, we have to find out. But it's little bit hard only. But no other go. We have to do like that. So otherwise, you have to memorize all the tables. Fourteen table, fifteen, sixteen. We have to. So four fours are sixteen. Four one is four. Five fifty six. So this also will not go. So again, what you have to do? Fourteen five zero, fourteen six zero. Like this, if you find out means it will be easy for you. For that only I am teaching like this. Understood? So uh, five four zero twenty. Five one is five. Five plus two seven. Six four zero twenty four. Six one is six. Six plus two eight. See, likewise, we have to uh, we multiply till ninety-two comes. Okay, if ninety-two is not coming, means we can take the uh, smaller be, uh, below uh, before number. Nine four zero seven four zero twenty-eight. Seven one is seven. Seven plus two ninety-eight. See what? Can you see, children? This one here. Fourteen twos are twenty-eight. Fourteen threes are forty-two. Fourteen fours are fifty-six. Fourteen fives are seventy. Fourteen six are eighty four and fourteen seven are ninety eight. But what our number is? What divided is given? Ninety two is there. So can we write this number, children? No. So what's the before number? Fourteen six are eighty four. Fourteen six are eighty four. So what you have to write here? Six. What you have to write here? Six. And you have to write eighty four. So eighty four. So. Uh, if you minus what will come? Can you separate from uh, uh, from here four to two? Can you count? No. So you have to borrow. So this twelve will become uh, two will become twelve and nine will become eight. So after four, if you count up to twelve, what will come after four? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So what's the answer children? 8. 8 is the answer. And 8 minus 8, 0. So this is what? Quotient. And this is reminder. And this is reminder. So what's the answer? How what we have to write? Answer is? Answer is what? Quotient short form Q. Quotient is 6 and reminder is 8. Understood children? Otherwise 0, 8. If you put otherwise you can write only 8. Understood? So the, the first thing is this is divided. This is divisor and this is quotient and this is reminder. Understood children? Okay, we'll do the next sum. Okay children, we'll do the second sum. 89 divided by 42. So what's the dividend children? This is dividend and this is division. You should not forget. You should not put this inside and you should not put this one outside. You can't divide. Understood children? You have to be careful. The first, this is dividend. This is dividend. 89 is dividend and 42 is divisor. The smallest number should be outside. Okay? So here, can you multiply 42, 1 side, 42, 42, you can tell children no. So the easy method is what? 42, 1 side, 42, all of them no. So from two tables, if you write, it will be easy. So 2, 2 is a 4, 2, uh, 2, 2 is a 4, 2, 4 is a 8. So we can write the 3, 3 also, so that it is correct or not. See, 3, 3 is a 9 and 3, 4 is a 12. Perceive. What's the dividend? 89 is the dividend. Here 84 is here. And here 129 is there. So what number we have to write? We have to write the before number. So what will come? 84. So 42 to are 84. 42 to are 84. So after 4, if you count up to 9, after 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So what's the answer? What's the reminder? 5. What's the reminder? 5. So this is quotient and this is reminder. So it's very easy. So don't forget to write like this. Understood? So answer what will come? Quotient 2 and reminder is 5. Understood children? Okay. We'll see the third sum. Okay children. We'll see the third sum. Third sum, uh, 82 divided by 9. 82 divided by 29. 82 divided by 29. So what you have to do? The dividend is 82. The dividend is 82 and the divisor is 29. Okay children, so what we have to do? We have to write the 29th multiplication tables. So how can we write easy method? 29 ones are? 29. Don't forget. 29 ones are 29. So from the two tables you can write 29 twos are how much? 2 nines are 18. 2 nines are 18. 2 fours are 2 twos are 4. 4 plus 1 5. See always you should not forget to add this number. Sometimes you, have, you are not adding so it becomes wrong. Okay. Next 29 threes are 3 nines are how many children? 3 nines are 27. 3 nines are 27. 3 twos are 6. 6 plus 2? 6 plus 2? 8. So what's the answer? 8. See, well, only 2 you can write because it's 82 only it's there. So in this, the dividend is 82. Can we write 87 children? No, you can't write. So what you have to write? The before number is what? 29 twos are 58. So 29, 2's are 58. 29, 2's are 58. Okay. So now what you have to do? We have to subtract. From 8, after 8, can you count up to 2 children? No. So what you have to do? You have to borrow from 8. This 2 will become 12 and this 8 will become 7. So after 8, you count up to 12 children. After 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So what's the answer? Four. And after 5, you count up to 7. After 5, 6, 7, 2. So what's the reminder? 24. And this is quotient. And this is 
reminder so what's the answer will come quotient is equal to 2 and reminder is equal to 24 see here still we didn't learn uh, by keeping decimal point okay children see if we go on the add keeping decimal point means uh, the sum the they, they didn't give in book here after only will they will give so no need if the remainder is more number also no need to worry you can write like this understood children okay we'll see the fourth sum okay children we'll see the fourth sum fourth sum 95 divided by 40 95 divided by 40 okay so what's the dividend children 95 95 is the dividend and 40 is the divisor while writing itself you have to say and write 95 the first number is dividend and the second one is divisor so here what you have to write you have to write the 40 table 41 41s are 40 so from 2 we have to write 42s are easy isn't it 80 and 43s are this also is 34s are 12 so what uh, can you see here 95 is given here 80 and 120 is that it has been crossed so what you have to write the before number is 80 isn't it so 42s are 80 42s are 42s are 80 so 95 minus 80 5 minus 0 5 9 minus 8 1 so what's the remainder children this 15 is remainder and 2 is quotient 2 is quotient 40 divided by 2 is 80 see easy method see 42s are 80 isn't it 42s are 80 and if we add this 15 if you want to check what will come 5 plus 0 5 5 plus 0 5 and 8 plus 1 9 see the answer has been come correct students can you find out see 42s are 80 and the remainder if you add means the answer dividend has come here so if you want to check you can check if you check means it will be very easy for you okay children we will go move on to the fifth sum Okay, children. Answer. I forgot to write answer. Quotient is equal to two, and remainder is equal to fifteen. Remainder is equal to fifteen. Okay, children. Now we will move on to the fifth one. Okay, children. We will move on to the fifth sum. See, don't get confused. If you go on practicing in the rough note, it will be very easy. It's it's not. You should not read. You should not read. You have to go through. You have to do and practice in the rough note. Otherwise, it's very hard. Understood, children? Okay. We'll go to the fifth one. Fifth sum, hundred and four divided by twenty one. Hundred and one. Hundred and four divided by twenty one. So what's the dividend here? One zero four. And the divisor is two one twenty one. So what you have to write? Twenty-one ones are twenty-one. So from the two tables you can write. Two one is two. Two twos are four. Twenty-one into three. Three one is three. Three twos are six. Twenty-one into four. Four one is four. Four twos are eight. Twenty-one into five. Five one is five. Five twos are ten. See here. Well, what the answer? Is, what uh, dividend number is hundred and four? But here hundred and five. But so can you put hundred and five here? No. So the before number is what eighty four. So twenty one four zar eighty four. Twenty one four zar eighty four. See, you have to write eighty four like this. Here you should not write eight eighty four like this. If you write eighty four, if you write eighty four like this, means it will be wrong. Understood, children? Always you have to start from the ones place. You have to start from the ones place. Four here and eight in the tens place. The hundreds place should be empty. The hundred place should be empty. So now you have to minus hundred and four and eighty four from hundred and four. So four minus four zero. And after eight you count up to ten. After eight nine ten two. So what's the remark uh, quotient? Quotient is four. And the remainder is twenty. So twenty 
so write the answer portion four and reminder is 20 understood children okay we'll move on to the sixth sum okay children now we'll do the sixth sum 345 divided by 42. 345 divided by 42. So what's the dividend here? 345. And the divisor is 42. So what you have to write? Uh, 42 ones are 42. So we can write from sec 2 tables. 42 twos are 2 2s are 4, 2 4s are 8. Next, 42 into 3. 3 2s are 6, 3 4s are 12. So, what's the answer? 126. Then, 42 into 4. 4 2s are 8, 4 4s are 16. 42 into 5. 5 2s are 10. And 5 fours are 20. 20 plus 1, 21. 42 into 6. 6 twos are 12. 6 fours are 24. 24 plus 1, 25. Okay, children. And the next one, 42 multiply by 7. 7 twos are 14. 7 4s are 28, 29. See, it's going on. But you have to find out. So, you have to do that one. Okay. 42 into 8. 8 2s are 16. 8 4s are 32 plus 1, 33. So, what you can do? See, you have to write this one only. Because 42 8s are means what? 9s are means what's coming? 9 2s are 18. See, 37 is coming. But what's the dividend here? 3, 4, 5. So here 3, 7, 8. So you can't do. So the next sum, you, next number only you have to write. So 42, 8s are. 42, 8s are 336. Okay children. So now what you have to do? You have to uh, subtract now. So can we subtract after 6? Can you count up to 5? No. So we have to borrow. So 5 will become 15. And this 4 will become 3. So after 6, if we count up to 15, what will come after 6? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So what? 9. 3 minus 3, 0. 3 minus 3, 0. So what's the remainder, children? 9. And what's the quotient? 8. Understood, children? Uh, so, you have to write the answer. Quotient is equal to 8 and reminder is equal to 0. Understood children? See, don't forget. Don't forget to uh, write like this. If you write like this only, it will be easy for you. If you write like this, if you do the sums like this only, it will be very easy for you. If you don't write like this, you can't find out the answer. You can't find out the answer. Children, don't waste your time. You go on practicing in the rough note, children. If you go on practicing in the rough note, it will be very easy for you. Understood, children? This continuation I will be teaching in the next class. Understood, children? Okay. Write neatly in the uh, class work note. Write neatly in the class work note. Draw a line for the rough work. Draw a line for the rough work. And you have to do one sum below one another sum. Don't do Two, don't do two sums in a, at a time. One one sum and side the rougher. Okay, children? Okay, we'll meet in the next class. Thank you.